proposed bill would allow students in Arizona schools to wear cultural regalia at graduation. It's a response to restrictions at some districts that just do not allow seniors to wear decorated caps. Last year, we told you about surprise senior Larissa Wong. She's a Valley Vista High School student who couldn't walk on graduation day because of the tribal decorations on her cap. The day of her ceremony, she and her family protested outside. Our Claudia Rupsich has more on the bill and why local families say this is about more than just decorations. That bill says a school district or charter school can't prohibit a student that's taking part in a graduation ceremony from wearing cultural regalia. It's got bipartisan support and 20 co-sponsors. Manaya Duncan may only be in the fifth grade, but she's already thought about what she'll wear when she graduates high school. I wanted to wear some of my regalia because like, I want to show part of my culture. Her mom, Violet, is Cree, and her dad, Tony, is Apache. Mommy. Mommy fancy. Their kids go to Mesa Public Schools and have been raised to follow their tribal traditions. I've tried like, learning the language, and I've like, tried, um, we've been going to shows, and we've been like, uh, I've been learning stories. I've been learning some dances. Violet says the proposed bill would allow all Native students in the state to honor their culture. I keep hearing these stories, you can't wear your regalia, you can't wear your moccasins, you can't wear your eagle feather on your cap. This is a huge moment that's happening in our lives, and by wearing a part of a regalia, that's showing that we honor and we are proud of our heritage. Both Violet and Tony wore an eagle feather on their graduation day. To be given the gift of an eagle feather is, is monumental. It's something that's passed down from generation to generation. Tony says graduation day has always been important for Native people. That's why they wear all of those different um, feathers and even different types of beaded items um, because they represent our warriors that are nowadays instead of the buffalo hunts, nowadays it's bringing back knowledge to the community. Mesa Public Schools graduation policy says students can wear a small symbol of their academic achievement given to them by a tribal government or its representative if it doesn't stand out compared to the rest of the graduates wearing the common cap and gown. The principal has to approve it. Representative David Cook is behind this bill. He told me the next step in the House is to make the language more specific. Cultural regalia will only refer to tribes that are recognized by the federal government. I'm Claudia Rupsich, ABC 15 Arizona.